Are you afraid to fight me yourself, you cowardly snake? I'm gonna hit you, fool, if you don't answer me! That ice arrow came in clutch, dude. Had about enough of you and your eyebrow. Who wrote this, a two-year-old? <laughs> oh, don't give me that smug face, Ben Affleck. Where's my real ending here? That right there was freaking luck. I would like to cross-examine the witness's pe parent. Oh! Fucking go, baby! Woo! <laughs> Crime scene for this guy. <laughs> oh god, his freaking face took him away from him. elements of the blood on them without realizing i'll filter the scanner to track the victim's blood particles that should lead me to the last person to see the victim alive maybe even the killer himself all right let's go ahead and follow where this guy is at y'all need to just move oh my god Oh, I couldn't just leave me alone now, could you? And of course, there's a Riddler associate. So I need to keep you alive. Not that Bennett kills her or anything, but you get what I mean. Tell me what you saw. There was this guy. He dropped the body there. He was weird looking. You won't believe me, but, well, he looked like Bruce Wayne. What? I know. Someone must have got to him. He was covered in cuts and bruises, but I'm sure it was him. The poor guy must have had a target the size of Gotham City painted on him. It looked like he'd been attacked by pretty much everyone in Arkham. There may be more victims of the identity thief in Arkham City. I should look out for them. Looks like another victim of the identity thief. I need to scan the area to see if there are any more clues to his identity and whereabouts. I can see his face. The MO is the same as for the previous victim. His face is all right. Course, the killer paralyzes the vocal cords and then removes the face before bandaging up the head. It's definitely him, and it looks like he's stepping up his attacks. A crime with this level of precision requires weeks of premeditation. These aren't just random attacks. Oracle, I've reconstructed a clean set of fingerprints, but there's no match to anything in the Gotham criminal databases. I'm uploading the prints to you now. Check these against every record in the country. Batman, I found a 
match for the print, but there must be a mistake. This can't be correct. Who do the prints belong to? You. These are Bruce Wayne's fingerprints. How is that possible? Bruce Wayne? What? I have no idea. Bruce, I don't know how to say this, but... What's wrong, Barbara? I've been thinking about the identity theft case. Don't get angry. But how can you actually be sure that it wasn't you who killed those people? I mean, they were your fingerprints at the scene. What did you say? Not intentionally, but clearly you're not well. That place is full of maniacs who could take advantage of a situation like that. Think about it. What if Crane got to you again? You know Strange's reputation. Maybe he planted the idea back when you met him. I don't like it, but... It wasn't me. I'm sure it wasn't. Yeah, of course. I'm sorry. I just, well, you know. It can't be Bruce Wayne that did it. It can't be. There is no. I just really like how freaking like you gotta find them yourselves instead of like just automatic. Another victim. Sooner or later, the killer will slip up. Let's hope it's this time. Well, this time his face was covered. As with the others, the victim's face was removed pre-mortem with surgical precision. The care taken suggests the killer is more concerned with the parts he's taking than what he leaves behind. Someone has taken a lot of care to cover their tracks. They used bleach to destroy any forensic evidence at the crime scene. Sometimes the lack of evidence is all you need. I'll filter for particles of the bleach and see who was so determined to cover their tracks. I got you now. You made a big, big mistake, buddy. Just let me go. killed that man and dumped his body back there. Why did you take his face? It wasn't me. I just dumped the body. He told me to use bleach to clean it up. Who told you? Wayne. You know, the rich guy. You're lying to me. I'm not. There's an alley near the courtroom. That's where he is. He's crazy, man. You don't want to go in there. Good. 
these hideouts right over here. Can't be Bruce Wayne. There is no freaking way. We'll see. We'll see what's going on. The identity thief must have used our stuff. Myself. I take it you're here to stop me. What do you think? I think you're too late. You're a killer, a psychopath. I will stop you. Really? But you look just like Bruce Wayne. It took time, of course, to find the perfect donors, to graft on the flesh, and finally Holy to shit. lose myself in order to create this. Dude, Six I people die. Unfortunate, but necessary to complete my plan. Why would you believe good old fashioned revenge? <clears throat> to be honest, I don't care if you do. Wayne will suffer, and you will not stop me. I can see you have your hands full with Arkham City, but it's time for me to leave now. Pray we do not meet again. Next time, I will not be in such a generous mood. Crazy. Close the file on the identity thief, Oracle. Have you caught him? No. Prepare a new file on Dr. Thomas Elliot. I'm uploading all the details from his surgery. Elliot? The famous surgeon? Didn't you used to be friends? We were. A long time ago. So he was the identity thief? Hang on. This says he used the faces he collected to make a new one that looked like yours. I mean, Bruce Wayne's. Is he crazy? Uh, no offense. Are you going after him? He's gone. He's left Arkham City. I'll hunt him down tomorrow. Jesus Christ, dude. Freaking. Oh, yeah. Thomas Elliot Hush. <laughs> 